Hi everybody, so I'm gonna show you that when you share your screen in Zoom, you can also share the sound that's coming through your computer. So for example, let's say I'm playing this music video. Uh, you hear some music in the background, hopefully it's not too distracting. And I wanna share with my participants this video uh, with the sound going. How do we do that? So first of all, when you click on share screen, notice that, I'm gonna to go to the screens. Let's say I'm sharing this one, right? Notice that on the right hand side, okay, they're usually unchecked, okay? So they usually look like this. That means you will not be sharing sound. But if you check it, that means you will now be sharing sound. Now, uh, when you, when you, let me check one thing at a time and show you. So share sound, notice that the drop down menu allows you to choose between mono or high fidelity. I'm gonna turn this off for now. Um, mono or high fidelity, you can, you can select either one. Now, I haven't yet tested uh, how that really sounds to my participants. So those of you who have tested this, please comment below and, and share with us if that really does make a difference and if it's really worth doing. My guess is that f for doing high fidelity means that it takes more bandwidth from your computer and also from your participants' computers. So it may be more, you know, it may, may slow down the meeting or what I mean in terms of creating more possible glitches. I'm not sure. So just keep it on mono unless it's really important that they hear like amazing sound, um, then, then just probably mono is fine. And then optimize for screen sharing is something that I, um, again, it has to do with bandwidth. So if you do this, their experience of watching your video will be smoother, which means that it takes more bandwidth, it takes more of your computer processing power, it takes probably more internet bandwidth, and it probably takes more bandwidth from, from your participants, which again, if you tend to notice that your participants are saying that sometimes your video is choppy or your meeting is not stable, then you might not want to do that. Uh, anyway, if anyone else has any tips about optimized video sharing, please comment below. So I typically, um, yeah, I, I typically keep these two boxes checked and I keep it on mono. And then let's go ahead and share this. I'm going to click share now. Okay, let's keep, keep the music going here a little bit. Hopefully it's not too distracting. I'll turn it down a little bit lower. Um, now you can barely hear it. But anyway, uh, when after I've, after I've started sharing, I always double check. You see the zoom bar down here? Okay, I always click, um, I always click on more. Once I've, I've begun sharing, it says you are screen sharing. Once I've started that, I immediately click on more and I immediately check these things to make sure that they are indeed on. Because sometimes I've noticed after I started sharing, if I don't check this, it's off for whatever strange reason. It may be a bug or something like that. So I always share and immediately come to more and checking the share computer sound and checking the optimized video sharing. So anyway, I hope this is helpful. And those of you who have any other tips regarding all this, please go ahead and comment below. So thanks a lot. And I'm gonna stop screen sharing now. Here we go. And I'm gonna stop the audio. Okay, all right.